Well, hello, and welcome to another D -d -d Dice Breaker live stream. Um, it's Thursday afternoon. It's gloriously sunny where I am, which I'm not enjoying because I don't like being in direct sunlight. But it doesn't matter because tell you where there is or isn't a lot of direct sunlight, depending on where you are in the thing, is space. Yeah! So space is either very full of sunlight or not at all. So, wow. Yeah! Like that film Sunshine, right? Yeah, exactly. Um, mm. And I, I mentioned this, obviously, because, because we're playing Escape from the Dark Sector, which, if the, the name is to be believed, will be very dark. Yeah! Yeah, I would guess so. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. So the, banter, the banter train is really going, going at it today, isn't it? It's, it's, it's burning up on re-entry, quite frankly. But um, hello uh, to all of you watching at home. Um, uh, we are, yeah, we're going to play Escape from Dark Sector. Um, mm -hmm. We being, obviously, uh, me, Johnny, video man at Dicebreaker, Alex Lowley's other video person, and Alex Meehan, staff writery person. Yeah, that's um, what I do. <laughs> I've never played this before. Me neither. Well, I have a lot. Well, well, well. <laughs> this, is, this has literally so been, I... um, like, the last few podcast episodes have been yeah. me and talking about this game, so... <laughs> It's only apps that we play it. Yeah, I'm, I'm excited actually because I, you know, I've edited the last few podcasts, so I've I've heard a lot about this game. But I, um, yeah, I I'm, played the first game, Escape the Dark Castle, at UK Games Expo like three or four years ago. I think it was like new then. Was it new mm -hmm. then? I, feel, I think oh. it was. New then. Um, yeah, and that's that's the only experience I've had with any of these games. I had like okay, had so a what are we what are we looking at? Because there's a lot of space, there's a lot of space people. We've mm. got like a Hadley clone here. <laughs> We've got somebody with a tape deck in their skull. Yeah, up here. Like, uh, possibly... like out of um, out of Hellraiser. Oh yeah. Oh man. Yeah. Good shout. Yeah. Uh, this uh, one. Lieutenant this... Tanner. My God, that hair. Yeah. Very eighties. When we played this the other day, he said they look like Ripley. So, um, I think they do have a bit of yeah. there. Maybe not as curly. Yeah, I can see that. Mm. Yeah. All right. But what is, so what, what is Escape from Dark Sector? Uh, Escape the Dark Sector is, uh, well, as Lodi said, there's an Escape the Dark Castle, which is like a fantasy themed horror game. Mm -hmm. Uh, Oh no. Um, <laughs> uh, this game is very much like that game, uh, but mm -hmm. we're in space. Wait, space. Why? Space. Yeah. Uh, and there are actually a few differences compared to the last game. Uh, I'd say it's a more complicated experience, but it's mm -hmm. still very straightforward. So we'll be working together. Yes. This is no. lonely. <laughs> you did, You tricked me. You tricked me into this let's play by not revealing that information. Oh, sorry. I should have explicitly said, oh, by the way, lonelies, we're working together. Heaven, heaven forbid. I've been tricked. Well, uh, Halloween time is all about tricks and treats. And also, I hope true. I get a treat at least. <laughs> for, for playing this we shall game. see. Your treat um, is playing with me. Um, it 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 does make you sound like you are in space, Mian. But um, do you have the gain up on your mic at all? Because it sounds like you're peaking quite hard. Just as a as a by the way. Hmm. Let me investigate that. In the meantime, I'll, I'll tell some cool. space jokes. Oh, great. What, Please do. What did one shooting star say to the other? Please to <sighs> meteor. Is that better? Yes, yeah, that's better. Excellent stuff. Um, hey, you know, sometimes the MacBook decides that it wants to do something that it's not supposed to. Mm. Why are the man and the moon parties always a failure? There's just no atmosphere. All right, keep it up, keep it up. Tell us what this game is about, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll save Johnny by telling everyone what this game is about 
Um, Please do. <laughs> as I said, we'll be working together to escape the dark sector. So right now we're locked in a prison for reasons unknown. Uh, I don't uh-huh. know what we've done. We might be the bad guys. You never know. But regardless, we don't want to be in this prison anymore and we want to get out. And we mm. do that by traversing first the prison, uh, then we'll be in the sort of main section of the spaceship or the station. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then we'll be in this kind of other place that's like weird. It's fine. Okay. <laughs> Then we, is this how the rules explain it? <laughs> then, then we have to defeat a final boss before we can escape. Okay. Get on with our lives and do whatever we want to do. So interesting. Um, the first step we need to take is choosing which character we want to be. Oh yes. Um, you start picking. I'm going to read out the super chat from Josh Bunton. He says, Escape from Dark Sector sounds like an interesting futuristic sequel to the Escape from New York slash LA series, lol. Uh, um, that, it's, yeah, it's Kurt Russell with an eye patch. Um, yes. I think, it's, I think it's LA, the one where he, like they have that basketball challenge where you have to run the length of the court and score a basket. And it's like the beep test, and if you get it wrong, they shoot you. Um, which is all very scary. But also the... the Basketball court is surrounded by armed goons who are opposite one another. And it's like, you're just going to shoot each other. What are you doing? It's, it's very dangerous, I think you'll find. Um, right, I'm just going to uh, do two more Super Chat readouts and then we'll keep, keep going. Hello, I'm Duke Ken. There's another Super Chat, which is an animated Shiba Inu uh, sticking an arm in the air. And I believe that says, how's it going? Yeah. It's, it's going all right. Yeah. Thank you very much. Um, and CookieCat94 says, what do aliens on the metric system say? Take me to your liter. Yay, CookieCat. I actually enjoyed that one. Scary. Okay, I just so... want to point out that I picked Lieutenant, is that Lieutenant Taylor? Yeah. Because she looks exactly like me. She does look it's like It's actually you. not a bad likeness. Um, I will <laughs> say that the characters kind of matter in the sense that some of these characters are better at certain stats than others. Yeah, I noticed Oh, okay. Um, I'm we... good at seeing. Yeah. I've got a good eye. Loli's got a good, good eye. I'm a good decorator, apparently. Yeah. Okay, um, but you're bad at punch. You're yeah. bad at punch, yeah. Uh, Mean is amazing at punch. But I'm, ba- I'm, both... bad, at, I'm bad at eye. Um, You're fairly good at sprinkles, <laughs> but not amazing at yeah, sprinkles. Yeah, we're both medium at so, sprinkles. So I think I might actually take the one that... Lieutenant Abbott Yay! or Commander Yay! Hadley. Yes. Mm. Uh, so we are, we are balanced between the game's three core stats, punch, yes. seeing, and sprinkles. Um, <laughs> the game calls those stats might, cunning, and wisdom, but, but we can call wrong. them... We can call them anything okay. we like. To be honest, our friends call them something different from what you've called them. I'm not <laughs> going to repeat that on the stream because it might be rude. I yes. Uh, but uh, hey, you can imagine what that is. Um, we also get to choose a cybernetic implant. Amazing. Because we're we're in the future. So, okay. Um, um, they're over here on the other side from the character uh, sheets. If you need to zoom in, you can press Alt, by the way. Yes, you can. I'd, re- I'd recommend doing that because you can't see the writing from mm. from over here, really. Okay, so we've got a new um, override. Do we want to do it in backwards thing so Johnny goes first this time? Yeah, oh, why not? That's nice. Um, some of these are useful in, quote, close combat. Uh, or, quote, ranged combat, or outside of combat entirely. Wow. Mm. Uh, I, okay, I quite like the idea of the neural override, which is whenever you roll a double outside of combat before applying the result, I may change it to any single and apply that result instead. Yes, because there will be skill checks we will have to pass. Well, this seems versatile, and I'm assuming this goes down the bottom next to my medical record. You would be right. Wow. Lo- I like this already, actually. Do you have any idea of what you'd like to pick? Um, get a sense of 
things. Do we use a lot of combat in this, I'm assuming, because there's we a lot do. of combat. <laughs> okay. We do. Uh, it does depend on what cards we draw, but... I'm going to take oh. the combat pro protocol. That's a good choice. Okay, good. Good. Um... I will also take a combat base one. I'm going to take this weak point analysis. All right. Once per round of close combat, when I roll a double, may choose to apply any single instead. And you may block. Mm. Wow, you're getting even better at punch. Yeah, I'm basically getting roided up. Do your friends call it fisting? Is that what they call it? Whoa, I'm not saying anything. Okay. All right. I'm not going to get in trouble wow. with, with da other dad. It's just curious. It's just curious. Yeah. Um, I can neither yeah, well, confirm I'm... nor deny. Oh my god. Um, <laughs> Sorry, what? I saw that in the chat. Somebody was saying um, you're a chairman. and it makes you look like you've got really big shoulders because it's the same <laughs> colour as your jacket. I just saw it. Yeah, it's like, it's you... so true. <laughs> <laughs> it does a bit. I'm actually looking at it right now. You look um, like a linebacker. Yeah. Well, <laughs> what you haven't noticed is the fact that as I beef up my character, you know, I too am beefing up. <laughs> <laughs> so I can go outside and like punch an alien. <laughs> um, the last thing we do before we start is picking our starting weapon. <gasps> they are up here. Um, there is a ray gun which shoots uh electricity Can or I go there's first? there's a slug pistol which shoots um normal bullets you can see the the ammo and the fire rate well it, it looks like Logan yes. has already picked so i okay. guess we're taking a slug pistol apiece each of you got to go first so i thought it was only fair that i go first this time yeah, so I'll, I'll probably discuss combat in more detail when we get around to it mm -hmm. um, but for now very important um, we have to turn over each chapter card and read what's on there in a spooky voice, please. Okay. Um, we can nominate someone to do so because some of the cards say you specifically, which means whoever's reading it. And sometimes bad things happen to the person reading it, uh, which will become important when we start losing health inevitably. Okay. Now it doesn't really matter who does it. So, okay. buddies, I can see your hand hovering over it. Uh, if you very quickly click, and there we go, and then flip, and read out in a suitably spooky voice, please, what is written there? Overriding the sky. <laughs> this is not a very spooky piece of text. No, it's... <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to keep reading like that. Overriding the security protocol of the holding cells was no easy task. Oh, but God. now real danger lurks at every turn. Oh, you God. dart from your cell to the room, control room opposite. There, a map of the station flickers on a faulty monitor. You're going to be <laughs> literally... Four hours if you read in this page. You, you sound like you're running a village fate. And next we will judge the chutney <laughs> competition. <laughs> you, uh, my voices will change, don't worry. You will frantically oh, search good. for the location of your ship. Remove one act three chapter card from the mission deck without looking at it. The map vanishes. Replaced by an urgent transmission addressing all members of security. They have orders to eliminate you! You each grab a sidearm from the rack before setting off at speed. Draw one starting weapon card for each member of the crew. Then turn the first chapter card. <laughs> oh lord. <laughs> Oh Lord, I can't believe how long that took. <laughs> <you to do. laughs> okay. can't be rushed. When I said spooky, I didn't mean like, okay, you're on the verge of, of death here. Like, <laughs> spooky is is a broad spectrum, to be honest. I think yeah. you know we could have been more specific there, couldn't we? Yes. Okay, so we need to direction. 
in future. <laughs> Drawing a starting weapon card. We for... already we already did that. Ah, uh, that's what we did. Okay, that's fine. I sort of and jumped ahead of that. Then turn the first chapter card. I I jumped the gun with that. Hey. Hey. Uh, Johnny, would you like to turn the chapter card? Yes. And read it in a spooky voice. Yeah, but not like a really right, low let's, one. Let's okay. see us what you got. Let's see us what you got. Huh? Desperate to evade detection, you crawl into the foul-smelling ventilation ducts. Within, a deep rhythmic throbbing sound is punctuated by the metallic scuttling of <laughs> unseen creatures. Nominate one member of the crew to navigate this narrow, branching crawl space. They must roll two wisdom in three attempts. After each roll, all other members of the crew lose one HP from claustrophobia unless the total has been reached. If the total has not been reached after three attempts, the correct route is found by chance, and you all emerge exhausted and shaken, forever haunted by this harrowing experience. Yay. Oh no! We're so, in the vents, everyone. Wisdom so, is um, the eye one, Sprinkles. The right? sprinkles. 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 Uh, okay. Johnny is... Johnny's I believe I've got the highest... Sprinkler. I've got the highest... good at the sprinkles. <laughs> yeah, I'll do it. Uh, okay. So what you do is you pick up your crew die here, Johnny, on your your character sheet. Uh huh. And you roll that, and you have three attempts to get two wisdom. Okay. All right. Come on, Lieutenant Abbott. Oh, I like the way it says your name on your die. No, nope. that that's is a punch. That is a punch. So that's one damage. <gasps> that is that's two wisdom. wisdom. We did Yay! it. So, Lolies and I have to take one damage. Now, this is a bit tricky on DTS. Um, uh. You're going to have to use the pen, the draw um, tool, Lolies. So, if you hover your mouse over the draw and then select pen, and then what you do is you essentially make a we've, little dot on your graph. We've all drawn butts on TTS before. Yeah. So we've lost one health, so we go down to 11 mm. on your little medical record. Uh, I see. Um, Josh Bunton's done a super chat saying, Johnny, I want you to please read all your chapter cards in the skeleton voice from the Ox Ventures. I'll definitely do the next one, but I'll see how many I can do because um, it hurts my throat sometimes. Not, <laughs> not every time, but sometimes it hurts. Uh, it does seem like a very throat hurty voice. It, mm. The thing is, the first time I did it, it didn't hurt. And I don't know what's changed. Uh, mm. Oh well. Right, so uh, you're on eleven now. Yes, we are now on eleven. Um, health goes down surprisingly quick in this game. Oh good. So uh and there are very few ways to heal. Uh, ah. so we're going to have to be careful. Um Tremendous. But there are opportunities to take risks. So <clears throat> um shall I go next? Yes, yes. please. Oh no! Oh wow, this looks horrifying. They look unpleasant. Oh. Um, uh oh. You hurry around a bulkhead and collide with a pair of patrolling guards. They immediately open fire. Okay. <laughs> I need to roll two hit dice. Uh oh. Yay! Um, let me do that. I am hit once. Lovely okay. stuff. I take one damage. Um, while I've done that, we choose one option as a group. We can evade. Okay. We run. Drawing a further barrage of fire, all members of the crew must roll one hit die and then turn the next chapter card. Or we attack. Your training kicks in. Come back. Come back. Come back. Okay, so it's fairly obvious that Lolis is up for a fight. I think I'm up for a fight as well. Like, if I'm they're just saying. patrolling, oh, I guess we are escapees. I was like, that's not very nice if they just immediately open fire. We but are we are prisoners. We escaping. are fugitives. So they are technically doing what they're supposed to. But I will say, if we win the combat, we get two item cards. So I mean, we loot the bodies, you know. Yeah, we should do that, definitely. Mm -hmm. Beforehand, okay. though, I'm going to read out this um, this super chat from Zanzibar Thanks. White saying, uh, Skeletons do good. Uh, sorry, boss. It couldn't resist. There you go. <laughs> Yay! All right, so how do you combat, then? Right. 
firstly, I need to assemble the uh, enemy's dice. So assemble. Uh, we are ah. having to fight against two fists, and I and three oh. random chapter die. <gasps> We've Whoa. got a fist, an eye, and a sprinkle. Right. Wait, so where did you get that? Three random like chapter dice. Oh, oh, where wait. did you get the info? Yeah. Because right. I can so see the two right? fists and the eye. So this person symbol here is how many players are currently playing. Ah, uh, I see. So the, the uh, enemies are leveled, sort of. Gotcha. To well, how well, well. Play. Uh, okay, so we can choose to start combat in two different modes ranged combat or close combat. Mm -hmm. If we move into close combat, we cannot choose back to range. So, okay. logically speaking, uh, if you run up to someone and hit them, they're probably not going to let you go behind cover and <laughs> start firing. And start shooting. That makes sense. Yes, so Suppose right now, been well trained. we all have ammo for our guns. I'm going to give ah. ammo, but we have a single die at the moment. We can yes. reload as an action at points, and we can reload between chapters. Okay. But once we use our weapon, that yeah. ammo is gone until we do so. Okay. Uh, well, as, as you can see on this character sheet... Uh, the different ammo types do different damage. Ah. Uh -huh. So uh, Johnny and I's weapons do take away two dice, whereas Loli's only takes away one. Right. Mm -hmm. uh, so we could try ranged combat and then move into close. I didn't come here to not shoot a guard in the face. I'll put it that yes. way. Yes. So what we do is we we all simultaneously take our ammo die mm -hmm. that's the one on the gun uh, oh no oh low leads oh that's your die okay yep uh and then we roll oh we all come hit? on I yay oh, that's not mine good. hits okay johnny you my gun jammed yeah so you don't lose your ammo you just don't fire it that's fine. I hit, and Loni's hit as well, I believe. Mm -hmm. uh, so we can take away, um, I can take away two, you can take away one dice of your choice. So I might take away, yes, uh, I might take away an eye, and I'll take away another fist, why not? Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we did a decent chunk. And now we can all do our best things, right? So, Lolis, you need to discard your ammo die. Oh, yes. Okay. Used it. And now I suggest we move into close combat. All right. Scotty is the only one now with any ammo. Oh. Uh, so Didn't want now. To fire my gun anyway. <laughs> you can try it next time. No, it's fine. So, um, do we all have to do the same thing, though? So, it couldn't be like Johnny stays at range and we move in. That's weird. No, we have to go mm. as a group. Uh, so now we're in close combat. Um, we oh, sorry, I forgot. Lolies, you need to roll a hit die. Uh, actually, we all do, Johnny. Oh no! The hit die, and I need to roll a hit die as well. Yay! Nothing. Uh, I got hit. Mine just spun. Um, you can roll it again if you want. No, I take it. It's fine. Okay, so Johnny I got... and I get hit. Oh. So we take one damage. Okay. Um, oh, I need to take a damage from earlier as well. Well, we're doing that. Oh, One no. of my absolute favourite usernames uh, from our community, Wilf Chapman Gandhi, has mm -hmm. done a superb chat saying, Wait a minute, this isn't a painting stream. You're absolutely right, Wilf. Mm. But we're going to paint the walls with these guards as is his blood in a minute. Yeah! Well, so, Gandhi, watching now... the stream with some people, they're playing a game. What are their names? Lieutenant Abbott and also Taylor and Lieutenant Smith is there too. 
Hey, how are you? <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Great. Um, now we roll our, um, we roll our, our die, our special one, our crew die. That's the mm -hmm. white one you've got there, Loli. Mm -hmm. uh, we're all going to fight. Sure. Uh, we can also choose to take cover, which means we don't take any damage. Mm -hmm. We can choose to activate our medical drone. Mm. Which heals one point to one of us uh, for the rest of the act. <laughs> eh. uh, uh, or we can choose the flank, which is like a special attack. But for now, maybe we just just uh, I think we throw some this. throw some punches. Yeah, right, that's it. Go. Oh, come on! I got a punchy. I got I two got sprinkles. Punch. Right. So that means that. We discard the sprinkle here and a punch. Uh, Johnny rolled a, a block as well, so he doesn't get hit. But Lolis and I do. So oh, we no. take two damage each. Two um, damage? Oh, because of this? Yes. We, two damage? That's how many yes. super chats we've got to read. Uh, the Geek in the <laughs> North... Uh, has done a super chat saying a donation into the hat of Johnny the busker. Thank you very much. Uh, I've not been busking in must be ten years now. I made seven pounds fifty. It's Whoa. been ten years. Um, <laughs> up for yours. And Sam Sam Robinson has done a super chat saying just checking. Johnny, that's your house, yeah? Uh, no, this is not my house, but this is where I am temporarily staying while I'm between flats. Uh, thank you for asking. Can I ask Mian? Yes, hello. Why does is this how the scoring works, or is this just how you do the scoring? The and scoring. why does it work like this? What's yeah. score scoring? The health tracking. Oh right. <laughs> Whatever this is, yeah. <laughs> um yeah, I mean like if whatever works for you, my friend. If I just you, think it looks cool. If you find a better way of tracking what you're on, then feel free. But that's how but, I do it. But why why is it like this? Could you not just go down? Why is it like this? Could you not just do your dots downwards? I don't know. It's a graph. Because sometimes it goes up. Like, ah. Oh, so yeah, you need stuff. to plot it across time. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. And that, it means that was my you question, can see like... when you get hit harder, right? Because it only moves one square over, but it will move two down. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It will be like an echocardiogram, but not for how your heart's beating, but how dead you are. So yeah. it's kind of the same thing, I guess. I guess. Um, Actually, I took two damage there and I did it wrong. Uh, yeah. Lolis, your yeah. character is good at seeing, are they not? I am, that's why I rolled. But I, rolled um, I suggest that uh, Lolis tries to roll for this. Right, I'm and, doing it. Uh, I might use the medical drone. Right. Oh, Lolis just goes ahead. Go on, Taylor. <laughs> well, they're dead. Uh, I'm going to say I use the medical drone on my That's turn. Uh, Johnny, maybe you took cover or you re or you didn't need to reload. Let's right. say you took cover. Yeah, all right. Um, I heal one. I went to use the space toilet. Yeah, you went to use the space toilet while we were shooting. Well, uh, well a shootout was happening. Yeah. Um, like, Dan give me five minutes. Dan E has done a super chat saying, now it's a live music slash game channel. Secretly, it always was. It always Actually, were. It all, and it always were. <laughs> Look at this sweet loot we got. Oh, oh what do we get? <clears throat> we got a med pack, which means we can restore one health point to all members of the crew. <gasps> that is like solid gold, that is. That's pretty good. And we found a rusty pipe. Once per round of close hey. combat, when you miss, you may re-roll, applying only the second result. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Is it, so this belongs to all of us? And we choose who gets to take it. So we've got four item slots here. Um, does anyone have any preference for a, for a rusty pipe? I have what? a rusty pipe because my... Johnny, uh, may I my... ask... What? I think we should. I think we should give that combat item to the person with the highest punch stat. 
because it doesn't really matter. the punch doesn't matter in combat. It's literally just like. Oh okay. I was gonna it, it, say because it my what dice turn up really. Because my ray gun is weaker than your guns. Yeah. I was thinking, can I take the rusty pipe? Yes, that makes sense. Are you laughing because my character is really? I think it's called a rusty pipe. A rusty pipe. Yeah. <laughs> I know what happened when you were on the toilet. One of us came over and just pulled one of the water pipes like off the the wall. I didn't uh, know where you were going with that. But... Well, then Johnny said his character was on the space toilet. Yeah. Yeah. That's what happened in the narrative. Uh, uh, Titan Uranus has done a super chat saying, "Here is another contribution. I hope you find a new house before winter, Johnny." Thank you. It, it <laughs> well, shouldn't yeah, be at the moment he he looks to be living outside, so I wish. <laughs> I know. I know it looks like I'm outside. I'm in a conservatory. <laughs> Oh, uh, he's in the dark sector. I'm in the dark sector. I've yeah, just escaped from is. space prison. <laughs> <sighs> I've always wanted to watch an 80 film called Space Prison. It doesn't exist, but I want it to. Oh. Like, uh, I like prison stuff and I like space stuff. So yeah, I think I, that I, would work really well. Alien I, I, 3. Is, it, is that what Alien 3 is like? I've never it's seen set it. on a prison planet. Okay. Well, maybe I'll watch it now. It's not nearly <laughs> as bad as people say it is. I think it's actually pretty... I rate it. So there. Uh, Johnny, would you like the med pack? I'd love the med, med pack. Thank you. That can kill all of us. I'll carry that. Yeah, it kind of plays well into my habitual dad role, doesn't it? Yeah. You've also <clears> got <throat> a tape deck in your head, though. You see? Oh, yeah. Mine's huh. just right on the forehead. Yeah. <laughs> Easy okay. access. Uh, okay. Who wants to turn the next chapter card? Me, Ooh, me, me! It's, yeah, it's lovely. <laughs> this, is, this, is, this is turn. Oh, uh, apparently Riddick also uh, hits that oh, sweet spot between yeah. space and prison. What are calls of Riddick? Yes. You pass a room where an engineer is repairing droids. She That's is so spooky. absorbed in the work that you spot an opportunity to steal from her. As a group, choose one option. Move on. Why endanger the mission? Turn the next chapter card. Or steal. Nominate a member of the crew to try and roll cunning in one attempt. <gasps> Success, you definitely retrieve what you can draw. I can't read that because somebody's hand is in the way. Two item uh, cards. Or failure, <laughs> you fall loudly in the room, begin uh, combat. Oof. I am um, happy to roll, seeing as I'm Miss, Ms. Cunning. You are Ms. Cunning, but it depends whether we want to risk getting into a fight with this person. This is still quite a lot of dice. It's two, two fists, two eyes, and then three random chapter ones. Mm. Um... Uh, and uh, one sec, while we, while we are, uh, someone asked if Lolis was doing Boris Johnson there. Um, <laughs> Josh Bunton has done another super chat saying, Alien Resurrection was the second worst alien movie. I agree. Prometheus was tripe. Um, and uh, Emma Bunton said, what, what, what is this game and what is the objective? So we should recap for everyone, really. Um, this is Escape. Uh, escape the dark sector, where we are all space prisoners, and we've just escaped our space prison. Now we're trying to get onto our space escape ship and escape into space. Um, along the way, we are resolving these these chapter cards, um, such as this one. Are we going to try and mug someone who is repairing droids? This person is is of the work, the salt of the earth. You know, they're, they're working, the working person. But they're, yeah, but they're repairing, they're repairing prison droids. They're like, yeah. They are working directly on the tools of repression. I always think if there's an opportunity to steal, we should take it. Well, <laughs> things like I've been overrided. Well, th I actually think that this is very, very risky. Uh, I, don't, I don't want to do it, but I also... I, I just want it to I want it to be clear that I think this person is complicit in uh, a system that profits off uh, the misery of others, and I don't think that's okay. Yeah, I mean you don't know what that droid does. It could just be cleaning the toilets. It's true. I mean, I just went for the space toilet, and in fairness, they could they could use a bit of a clean up. 
Suddenly yeah, it's ripped a rusty point. pipe off the wall. It's flooding with I water. I know, it's terrible. That's okay. Cool. Well, you know what? It's early in the game. We could get two more items if we murder this person. <laughs> or we could just get off scot-free if, if Lonies does it. We don't need to murder this person at all. Like, there's no murdering. Only if you Only loudly if you fall detective. into the room. Yeah, so it's, it, it's essentially, do you trust me or do you not trust me? I, I certainly trust you to go in there. <laughs> what happens after that is, we'll see. Um, go for it. Why not? Yeah, let's 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 let's, let's humor lowlies. I really don't think I'm gonna roll this, but I would like to try. I would like to try. All right, here what's we go. Your, oh, no. Uh, oh, what's your special ability? Oh no, you can't do. Uh, that, well, you uh, failed. I failed. Um, we begin combat now. Because Yay. now fight this person. You because fall you loudly me. into the room. Yeah. That's I'm just going to sneak yeah, in and bang. Yeah, you trip. Presumably, you trip over a bucket of some sort. Mm. Uh, and then that this person is like, "You're not supposed to be here." You're not a droid. You're I'm not gonna. A droid. I'm not gonna repair you. I'm going to break you. Yeah. You I have a question. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. Um. The guns. Oh shit. Uh, language. Uh, space language. Space language. Oh, space did, swearing. Did you fall? I did. I said oh, whoosh. <laughs> like a like a spaceship <laughs> flying past the window. The, the anyway. Spaceships don't make noise in space. <laughs> it's a vacuum. It's fine. Yeah, no, but flying past my window here. Um. Anyway. And it's not a spaceship. <laughs> Uh, Spaceships have to get to space in the first place. Carry on. Right, thank you. Um, here is my question: the yeah. guns are they out of ammo? Does it is a chapter, or are we on the next chapter? And we've got ammo again. Uh, either what we can take the reload action during combat, or we can wait until the next chapter where we get reload. When's the next chapter? I reckon at the end of all these. Oh. I reckon it's after this card, because there's four of each chapter. Oh, uh, okay, cool. You see, sorry, <laughs> act. I meant act. Okay. There are there are three acts and there are four oh, okay. cards. Okay. So. Okay. Well, I've still got ammo. Mm -hmm. uh, do you two want to reload? Is yeah, my... Lonely and I could, could take the reload action while you shoot. I don't really mind. Uh, how much damage? Okay. Well. You could potentially do two damage with yeah. your So we could we could give that a go. Let's do it. Right, Lolis and I are gonna reload, so we will take Okay. A die. <laughs> Alright. Here we go, ballistic die. Yeah, come on. Hey! <gasps> that is four damage. Four damage. Absolutely slammed. What do you want to get rid of, Johnny? Um, these four, I reckon. These ones. Yeah. Excellent just... work. Oh, you should have um, left an eye for me. Oh, there is an eye there. Sorry. There is an eye there. Yeah. Not bad. Why don't you have to roll a hit die? Okay. But... Come on. Yay! Yes. Um. Johnny, well, roll good. I need a. I need a quip. Um. Uh. Uh, beep boop, I say. My gun smoking. <laughs> Your gun is smoking? In a yeah. nice smoking area? Yeah, yeah. I, I just... just imagine the gun like... Yeah, my gun's just, yeah, like... <laughs> That's what I do, baby. Yeah, That's I said, nice one, does. Mr. Gun. And I jammed a corn cob pipe into the barrel. And <laughs> lit it for it. Um... Fat, fanning the hammer to get it going. Yeah, uh, I'm. I'm gonna shoot. Oh no. Um. Wait. Yeah. Does that mean I have to shoot as well? Because I want to. I think it would make sense to do. Wouldn't it make sense for all of us to do close combat now? Because then we can finish them off. Yeah, we can do that. Because then you can keep your ammo for the next one. Yeah, mm. that sounds like a. That's an excellent idea, Loli. Um, okay. question from the chat. Daniel J. Vaughan the third. 
asks, what's the point of the stats? It doesn't seem to affect the dice rolls in any way. Um, I believe all of our dice are personalized, right? Yep. Yep. So I'm, I'll, I will simply have more sprinkles on my dice than, than anything else. Well, I have more punches. Which is very neat. I think that's great. Yeah. It just makes the... It doesn't... You know, it's not the most amazingly personalized thing, but it still makes the characters... Yeah. Like, this is my die. There are many yeah. others like it, but this one is mine. Yeah. I am the one and only. <laughs> That's what the die says. <laughs> right. Are um, we all rolling here together? Yeah, like, Johnny, like you want to roll with us? Yeah, roll with us. Uh, so, oh, for the close roll, combat. You're cool roll enough with to roll with us. Oh, thanks so much. <laughs> Get in, nerd. We're going space fighting. All right. Let's go. Oh, that was a really bad roll, but I got an eye. Mm. Two sprinkles. I got a Nothing. fist. Okay. So Loli's got an eye. You got a fist. Did either of you roll a shield? No? Uh, e... No, I didn't, but whoever rolled sprinkles uh, did. I did. Uh, Loli's didn't even... Uh, you both have to take two damage. Ouch. This engineer whacked you with a wrench. That's not nice at all. Rude. Uh, what's left? A punch. Gosh. Um, may I suggest I try and do this on my own because I am the good at punches, or at least me and Johnny. Because no offense to your character, Lonies, they're not very good at punching. Can I do the the medical thing that you did last time? Uh, unfortunately, it's been used. Oh, by is it? Ah, uh, the med droid is. A... Can only do it per chat. To, sorry, per act. Um, however, Johnny does have a healing item that we can use. Uh, to restore one HP to all members of the crew. At the end of this chapter, hype. Alright, well, yeah, fine. So, um, yeah, you, you, you punch them by yourself. Um, Gun and I are going to go smoke in the toilet. Okay. Wait, what do I do then? You could take cover, Lolis, or you could just be like, oh, I'm going to go and look in this hole in the ship. That's. I mean, I could, I've been rolling a lot of punches, and if I miss, then I've got my rusty pipe as well, so I might as well help you in case you don't oh, roll a punch. that is a, a very punch. good point. You can help if you want. I'm just yeah. yeah. I think I think that's a very very good idea. Okay. Punch. Yes. Down, lowlies. There you go. Honk honk. Yeah, I might be weak, but I still pack a punch. That's what I say. That's my okay. Name. That your that, quip. <laughs> that was much better than beat boop. <laughs> well, th this engineer is now mur murdered. Great. Oh, sorry. Uh, it's draw. It's half made drawing to sort of going like parent. Mm. What have you done, creator? Yeah. Look, it was the engineer's fault for not deliberately ignoring the fact that Lolis ran into the room and stacked it noisily. Hello. That's all I'm saying. Please, because I... Um, a Wallach asks: After you roll a hit, how are you determining which dice to remove from the enemy? It has to match what you've rolled. Yep. Correct. Or when we're doing range, we can choose whatever we like. But if it's close, it has to match the die. Yeah. Mm. Thank you. We have pills. Restore Unmarked one health pills. to your crew member. Or a chrono bomb. I mean, that sounds awesome. Would you like that, Johnny? No, it's no, I, do, I just appreciated it. I've got my med kit. That's all right. I mean, I'll carry it if you want me to. Just, I think you, you know. should, I think you should have it. All right, Dad will carry the chrono bomb think, as well. I think you should take the pills, because I fear you are low health. But it's for a crew member, so surely somebody else should take it so they can put it on me. They can use it on me. Your crew member, it says. Yeah, your crew member. Oh, whoops, sorry. Mr. that. Which I read as cucumber, so. So I reckon you should use that now, Lolis. Oh, can I? Health. Yeah, sure, I will. Um, Mattress757 says, Johnny, how come you sound like you're indoors despite being outdoors? Well, it's because I am both indoors and outdoors. Whoa. I'm in a conservatory. What happens to this card? It goes into the discard pile. <gasps> wow, magic. It is <laughs> it's magic. It's not magic, it's science. Oh, yeah, I mean, you're right. Um, right, whose go was it? To read out. Is it I you, read Johnny? that one. It's me. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, Whoa! wow. This one, this one looks genuinely spooky. Ahead. Two. Oh, no, wait. I said I'd do the next one. It's going to be like. 
<clears throat> I had uh, two elite guards uh, marching an uh, alien prisoner to the brig. Uh, as a group, we choose one action. Do we attack because their gear might prove useful and thereby begin combat? Do we hide, slipping into the shadows, trying to avoid detection as they pass? Um, all members of the crew must roll their crew die once and no might must be rolled. So you have to try and contain your fists of fury. Oh, that's very uh, hard. Well, those, those are the two options. Um, I think we attack. <laughs> I'll okay. tell you for why. I'll tell you for why. Lolis is on full like. No, I mean, uh, I mean, okay. I think aggro. Right, we're, we're prisoners who are escaping. I think yes. it would be a bit of a, a a mean move by us to not try and take take a friend with us, mm. a fellow also, prisoner. It does it look? It says one guard drags the prisoner away and the other comes after you. Um, does that mean if we fail and then we win the combat, we don't get the items, or...? No, we do. We'll get the items anyway. We get them regardless. Like, okay. It's just whether we want to try to not be in combat or not. I mean, the idea that you are trying to sneak past somebody and you're just desperately sweating, like, don't punch them in the head... <laughs> no, no, is not again, Fist. It's so funny that I think we have to try and sneak past. <laughs> Okay. It's been like, yeah, the not again if it's like, no. I'm going to tell you, no. though, I've been rolling a lot of fists. Yeah, so. Lonely's just been rolling a lot of fists. Hey, look. If, percentage wise. I'm not going to judge you if, if you can't stop yourself from oh, punching these guards fists. in the face, but I just, I, want you, I just want you to try to prove to yourself that you can at least try not to punch them in the face. Oh, Are you ready? Rolling. Hey! Yes! Yes! We're so sneaky. That was great. Okay, so. Um, success. Uh, you all stay hidden. Turn next chapter card. We made it through the first act, everyone. God, that was very, very funny. We uh, <laughs> we made it out of the space prison. Awesome. So we can reload now, right? Yes, we can reload, and you can use any items you have. I was going to say, should we use that med pack now? I think it might be a good idea. Yeah, let's do that. We Disco all heals one. Everyone heals one, yeah. Stuff. I, I like this graph thing. Yeah, I mean, I like the aesthetic on this whole thing. Yeah, it, I do. It very, very much reminds me of like the original editions of Cyberpunk. Like, um, it's the got 1%. a very retro feel to it, for yeah. sure. Yeah. Like the boxed version of the original Cyberpunk, which was set in 2012, is like it's very much like this, and it's gorgeous. And then 2020, obviously. But. Right. So we've done all our things. Mm. Uh, we now proceed to the next act. And if you were listening to the soundtrack that this game has, which why is are we not for free on? I mean, you can if you want. You can search it. Um, it's for free on YouTube. And mm. uh, there's a there's a track for every act. And wow. Turning to act two now. So the, is this like um, have you played this scenario before, man? This scenario, uh, there's not really scenario. It's, it's more random. Mm. So I, I make a deck up using these cards on the left here, uh, and they're randomised every time. Um, but there's four in each act in your in, in our deck. Oh, okay, so it's given that there are like what thirteen cards? No, more than that. It's about well, sixteen, I guess. Uh, yeah, that's quite a lot of possible combinations. Yeah, I mean, obviously, because I will say I've played this game a lot over the last week and a half or so. So I've definitely, mm. obviously, seen repeats of cards. But that's yeah. natural when you've played the game about six times now i think something like that uh yeah. possibly more but i've not seen this one we've just done for example <sighs> before Amazing. so i think it does help if you take out the cards you've already seen we've been kind of doing that but right. also i don't think this game is meant to be played six times in the space of a week and a half Probably how many most. cards are there total of these like story cards I don't know that off the top of my head, but like roughly like Well the disco the, the remaining ones there are twelve act one and twelve act two cards left. So there's each act's... Only, uh, there's only thirteen in there because I've taken one out of the deck and there's 
there's normally 14 or 13. Yeah, there's normally 12 plus a boss card in here. Yep. Um, so 13 so, plus 12 plus 12 plus 13. Oh, uh, gotcha. I think there's numbers. Yeah. Okay. I think there's 24 whatever, each four of the acts. I think oh, there's that's not so bad. Acts each, and there's four boss cards and three starting cards, which is new as well, because in the previous game there's only one starting card. And the starting cards are different. Like mm. the one we had takes an act three card out, but gives you fewer items to start with. Mm. Whereas another one gives you more items to put some, like an, an extra chapter card in there. And another one is just like a middling ground. Like, mm. But I, you're, I think you're supposed to pick randomly, but I think you can choose one depending on what kind of game you want. So, mm. um, um, I think we should flip a card because I'm getting sad looking at this poor prisoner that we left yeah, to, their, to their fate. See you well, later. Yeah, we, <laughs> they're off to, um, to sit in prison. Um, oh, they're going to be turned into glue. Possibly. Like a horse. Oh, okay. I think it's me, is it? It is, yes. Yeah. Oh, that's the whole deck. Come on. Oh, no! Oh, gosh. You're being, is someone being dissected by spam monsters? <laughs> um, oh, um, just going to read a quick super chat. Teresa S has done a super chat saying, testing to see if this works. Last stream it didn't. I guess it's a bug, unless you've banned me from giving you money? Question mark. Uh -huh. We haven't, Teresa. Um, thank you very much for the money. I'm glad that your super chatting ability has returned. Um, yeah, I don't know what that was. It must, it must have been a bug. We'll, we'll, examine, we'll examine it, yeah. just as there seems to be some form of spooky examination oh. happening now. Tell us about oh, it, Mia. No. Okay. You pass a medical bay where someone strangely familiar is being clumsily dissected. It's the alien! I swear it's the alien oh, prisoner no. that we just... Peering in, you notice some unattended supplies. I told you we should free him. Now look at what's happening. <laughs> oh As a group, choose one option. Move on. It's too risky. Or steal. Nominate a member of the crew to roll two cunning in two attempts. Ah, oh, easy, mate. It's fine. <laughs> You want cunning. To steal. cunning sprinkles. Look at me. I'm chock full of sprinkles, mate. Cunning no, cunning is the eye. Oh. oh, me? Oh, no. I'm, I'm, Sorry. Uh, no, God, no. Yeah. No, Lowly's is the one who's good at cunning. Okay. I mean, I think we should do it because I we mean... get two <laughs> item cards. <laughs> Lowly's is also the most inclined to to commit I, there, Yes, so. I think we, we don't even need to discuss this one as a group, do we? It's fairly obvious. Well, if we fail, I don't think it's too bad. No, uh, it's just area. three HP loss for, for lowlies. I'm fine with right, that. Right, have two attempts to roll two, two eyes. Go. <laughs> no, right, try again. That's a sprinkle. Uh, no, so many sprinkles. Okay. So in, an, in a, yeah, an emerging theme, you do something very clumsy. Do you want to read it out there? Failure. You stumble and overturn a large vial of acid, spilling it down your legs. You lose three health points, barely stifling your cries of agony. You withdraw just as your presence becomes noticed. Lonely, you've got acid on your legs. Ah! Sorry, I'm yeah. doing maths right now. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, oh, that's bad. Maths. Yeah. Free health is a lot. Yeah, you just melted your kneecaps off. Yeah. Lowly's is on six now. Ouch. Oh, yes. I never wrote my name. Uh, I'd like to see you try. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, that, that's not. It's actually pretty good. Terrible. Right, you do yours and then I'll try and do mine. <laughs> I mean, mine is, right. is white, so. Yeah, that's you can change the colour of the pen. You can change the colour, yeah. Nope. <laughs> right, let's give this a Oh, go. God, cursive was a mistake. Yeah, I did cursive. Well, did I? I think I did. Oh, yeah. Whoa! <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Jeez. Giant blob! 
<laughs> Smith, I, that's legible. She you can tell that's actor. Smith. What are you a Wait, doctor? Come on, Johnny. Oh. Oh yeah, I've already done it, mate. <laughs> It's got two teeth. Uh, I can see uh, the beans and teeth. Yeah. Uh, who is it? Lowly. Lowly's. Yeah. yeah. Remember, anyone can back out at any time if they're low on health. Oh no. There's <laughs> a blinding flash of somebody's pen is on the way, and I can't read. Sorry. That's not me. That's Johnny. If you hold, if you hold. Flash as the fabric of space time is torn apart before your very eyes. Whoa! Burst through the unstable portal and instantly opens fire! You must roll a hit die. Then, as a group, choose one option. Uh, evade, you rush forward as a unit, forcing the assassin back into the portal just as it closes. All members of the crew lose one HP. Or attack, you take up defensive positions and begin combat. Right, first well, of all, I have to. Roll. Yeah, you have to roll a hit die first, Lonely. As this time traveling assassin. Um, yeah, that's like steady on. I think we should attack. <laughs> and I'll tell you for why. You've just. Okay. okay because you it's, go. It's either we take, we automatically take one damage each, which I can't really afford hmm. to do, or, okay. or we just try and kick his butt real quick. We do. We do all have ammo. We do all have ammo. Uh, um, oh. And they could provide some form of healing thing because Loli's is on five. Yeah, hit it's not doing great. Having just thrown a vat of acid over your own legs. <laughs> Loli's could use the medical drone as well. We yeah, but only gives him one. Defense. Yeah, but it's better than nothing. Well, the thing is, it's going to take two attacks no matter what, right? Because it's got there's going to be like six dice there. Well, why don't you roll your hit die first, and we'll see what that does. I, I already took my hit. Oh, you took a hit? Okay. So that was two damage. That's the thing with the range damage. It, this this person does more damage on a ranged level than on close combat. Mm. Um, also, they don't have that many dice, considering. Yeah. Well, this yeah. is what I mean. Why don't we do... I reckon uh, we should just go for close, because yeah. none of our weapons do, like, double okay. damage or anything. Yeah, we can go to close, and then... Um, it's going to take probably two rounds of combat anyway, so I can just um, heal in the second round or something. Yeah. All right. I reckon we go straight into close. Punch! So, uh, two fists. And I... And three random... Chapter die. Ooh, all three, huh? Sprinkles. Nice okay. range. Oh. Now you're talking my language. Sprinkles. <laughs> I speak the language of sprinkles. Um, sprinkles. right. So who wants to fight? Who wants to do other things? I think we're all fighting. Aren't oh, we? so... Straight in there, swinging. Yeah. Okay. Let's a go. Roll, roll, roll. Right. I rolled a I rolled sprinkle. Wisdom. Oh my god, we. I rolled an eye. Okay, god. well, we're definitely getting rid of the sprinkle. Okay, we have three fists and an eye. I didn't roll to block, none of us did, so I take one damage. Okay. Uh... I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do the medical all... thing this time. Because I'm gonna that's a... Yeah, uh, that's a good do idea. Do we all take one damage? Um, sorry? Do we all yep, take one damage? None of us rolled okay. blocks. Cool, cool, um, cool. I um, think, uh, Johnny, how are you doing health wise? I'm fine, I'm on nine. Shall we try and beat this person up? Yeah. Uh, I'm not here to fornicate with the rap. Sam Robinson says there's a lot of people bursting in and shooting you in this game. That's very yeah. true. It seems like every corner there's someone wanting to shoot. Well, it's dangerous. Oh, great. I rolled Sprinkle again. Oh, for God. Oh, um, I'm going to use my cybernetic. When you when I roll a double, I may choose to play any single instead. I still block. I'm going to take a fist away. I just realized I could have mm. fixed that because I have the rusty pipe. Uh, Johnny, you take uh, a damage. I do, yeah. Uh, right, Lolis, did you heal? I did. Excellent work. Did you want to join in on the fight, or...? I do, I do. Right, um... 
Matt Jarvis is in the chat. He says, I'm a big fan of Mustache Astronaut. Yay! Hard, but very <laughs> pleasing to say. Mustache Astronaut. <laughs> right, we yeah. all ready? Take this, assassin. Two eyes. Two eyes. Fist. And who, did anyone roll a fist? Me. Excellent work. Lolies, did you roll an... Oh. You rolled... I'm going to keep mine because I've got a shield. Lock, yeah. Um... You just don't take hey. damage, but jo Johnny and I do. I'm fine. I'm on seven yeah, yeah. hit points. Seven. You're right. It was definitely worth us all doing this rather than voluntarily taking one hit point. Yeah. I'm really glad yeah. we did it this way. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that, doesn't sound, uh, that doesn't sound like you mean it. <laughs> all right. Are we going what? again? Yeah. yeah, well, we get, yeah. We get, we're going to get items, right? I got an eye. I got two punches, right, dead. Fist. <laughs> Fist. Mm -hmm. right. Do we still take damage even though no, they got eliminated? No, they died, well? so. <laughs> take that, smelly astronaut. Brain stims. That's pretty good. Change a result to wisdom. Another chrono bomb. I might take the brain stim because I'm not very good at sprinkles. Oh no, I'm not terrible at sprinkles. Lolis and I are about as good, equally good at sprinkles. Mm, I've been rolling out of sprinkles. I will take it then. I've been pretty much rolling anything but I, which is supposedly my my strong point. Mm. Um, so. mm. Yeah, you take the chrono bomb. I've already yeah. got one. I, I couldn't possibly eat a second. Uh, right. <laughs> what? I can't tell if you're being sincere. About what? About the chrono bomb. No, it's like, well, where are you storing your stuff? Like, no. straight in there. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, Why do you think I keep going to the space toilet? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, he, he poops it out and then he pops it back pops in. <laughs> um, people are asking if Lolis has the right die. Yeah, yeah, she does. Yeah, sure do. Sometimes it's yeah. just random number. There's my name yeah. on it. Um... I think it's it's Johnny next, is it? Really? Um, I think so. What did we have? We have Johnny. I think that was like he did the, yeah, the yeah yeah the space right. assassin. Well, oh wow! Look at this guy. I would hang that up on my wall. Yeah. You encounter a vision seller peddling the very latest in sensorium stim. Fight, fight. No matter what it is, just fight. That's fine. He <laughs> offers you his trodes. And your choice of experience. Each member of the crew must choose one option. Refuse, you don't mess with that stuff. Never have, never will. Oh. Trade, trade for a bliss vision. Uh, discard an item card. You jack in and gain one HP as you experience glorious revitalizing sensations. Test something experimental. Experimental. Uh, there is no cost, but can you handle it? You must roll wisdom in one attempt. <gasps> I'm going to do uh, that one. <gasps> success. The vision cannot be expressed in words. You gain 3 HP. <gasps> or failure. The trip turns bad and you rip the trodes from your temples, unable to shake the disturbing images. You lose 1 HP. I I'm think gonna, I should do that. I'm going to do the, exper the experimental thing because I have my, my stim. Uh, that oh, we all, oh, yeah. oh, we all get to choose our own. Die. It, is wisdom sprinkles? Wisdom. Mm -hmm. Right. Uh, wisdom is sprinkles, yeah. Right. I mean, right. So my choices are essentially: do I take one HP, or do I do I play the game and try and get three? Three. You can discard an item to try and get one. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. But I think I am so low in health. I think I should try and get three. Gamble. Let's all do something dangerous and experimental. Well, I'm gonna roll. Uh, oh, look! I got it. Oh, oh no. lolies. Come on, sprinkles. Not sprinkles. Don't, don't you have the thing, Johnny? Whenever you uh, whenever you roll a double outside of combat. I'm the only one who got it, and I'm the only one who could have like automatically got it. Oh well. Uh, I experience an amazing oh. thing. I, oh, I'm uh, what? Can I use the chrono bomb? Yeah. You don't have to use it in combat. I'm gonna use it. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, that's cocked. Oh, I better roll it again. I didn't know dice could be cocked on TTS. No. Oh, so close. I mean, but... 
I tried. I really did try. Right. I, I can't believe you're sat there, Min, telling us about your brilliant trip when you've just seen us rip troads from our heads and now we're gibbering and oh, we're bleeding slightly yeah, from yeah. the scalp. Well, and you're like, oh I'm my like, god, you'll never believe. I'm like, um, I went to Cyber Thailand. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, oh man, that banana split was so good. That's your experimental bliss yeah. vision. <laughs> yeah, it's just me eating a banana split. <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> I've never experienced such pleasure. Uh, right, have we all taken damage, taken health, whatever? Yep. Right, yep. I will draw the next card. I think this is the last chapter card in an oh. Act 2 is... <gasps> Big finale. Well, you hurry on, passing through the engineering deck where a neglected warp cell is in the final stages of destabilization. It pulses erratically, the overloaded core throwing out crackling tendrils of irradiated energy. All members of the crew immediately lose one health point from exposure. Oh, come and on. And must each make a choice. We can go left or go right. Right. Well, do read the consequences, Lilith. Oh, I There's mean, a... I uh, well, that's Mian's job. Oh, sorry. Uh, we can go left. <laughs> Shielding your eyes, you exit swiftly and unharmed. Or go right. Dash into the danger oh. zone to raid the supplies. No. Suffering severe burns yes. in the process. Lose an additional health point and draw an item card. I'm on three health. I can't go yeah, right. Yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> Uh, I could do it. I've got loads of health. All members. I wow, know. yeah, you're doing brilliantly. I'm, yeah, I'm going to go left. Oh, each must make a choice. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I might go right and see if we can get a healing thing for Lodi's. Ooh. Yeah, go for it. Um, I need a glass of water because my throat hurts. Okay. So I'll be right back. Uh, I'm sorry, everyone, that the game won't really change while I'm gone, but, uh, you know, give me one sec. Well, that's not what we want. What'd you get? Uh, after one your crew die and before the result, you may change result to might. There's a lot of changing die items, isn't there? Like, I feel like a lot They're of the pretty items... They're good, because you can basically just automatically pass a, a, a skill check. I think you should get it, because you're not very good at punching. That's and true. That's what might is. So that gives you an automatic success, basically. It's a shame it's not a healing item! Mm. But we do get our drone back. Uh, we've already got ammo. We haven't found any cool weapons this game, I must admit. Usually you do. But no. Alas. Um, alas, alack, yes. Lolis, I think you were reading next. Right, should I go? Yeah. Okay. Whoa! Oh, Lord, these oh, guys this again. is bad! Okay, you black out. Waking to find yourself, oh man, I can't read that. Uh, strapped to a metal table under blinding lights. You cannot move for hour after agonizing hours. Shadowy figures with large eyes and long, sharp implements prod and probe you, extracting flesh, bone, and worse. To endure the abduction, you must roll your crew die five times. For each result, which is not might, you fail to resist the pain and lose one HP. Then, read on. It's a good thing, Lolis, that you got that item, huh? Huh? After right, five rolling times. a crude eye before applying result, you may change oh. the result to might. Right, I've got one. One might. Oh, look, you can change it to might. I'm oh. changing it, I'm changing it. No, it's not discarding. Oh. You permanently oh. keep it. Oh, you can oh. do it as many times as you like. Oh, okay. My... Uh, that's definitely a might. That's also a might. That's such a might. That's a might. And would you look at that? That is We've also a might. Yeah, that's actually a might. <laughs> oh, look, you don't lose any health. Or might. Uh, you black out again. Oh, wait. You black out again! <laughs> when you next come round, you are being cradled by your crewmates. 
You fainted, they inform you, but have only been unconscious for a few seconds. Whoa! What happened? Johnny, you, I mean, are you confused? Uh, well, no. I mean, it seems pretty clear to me. Taylor hit the deck and then stabbed herself in the head with a with a bunch of stims with the rusty five pipe. times. Yeah, all and a rusty of pipe. Stims. Yeah. It's that's a good, amazing. That's amazing that I got that item. It that was the item is. I literally got last time. Yeah, me and just gave me that item like two seconds. And if it wasn't for that item, I would have taken three damage and I would be dead because I only have three health. Wow. Yep. Oh, saved my life, me and. Wait, I, mate, that's what we're here for. We need to get out. <laughs> we got to get out of this prison together. I need to stop fighting people and just. <laughs> This yeah, that's. Bad. You need to stop fighting people. <laughs> this is what you get abducted, but do you? Oh. Oh. All right. Uh, Johnny, what are you on health wise? Uh, I'm on five. Do you want to pick the next chapter card? Sure. Or I can do it. Uh, I just. Is it? If you're scared of losing health, I don't know. Oh, I see. No, I'm alright. Okay. Oh, oh. Okay. The doors of <clears throat> the doors of this room lock behind you, and an alien terminal slowly rises from its center. It must be operated carefully. Nominate one member of the crew to work the alien controls. They must roll wisdom in one attempt. Success. Oh, you study the symbols, seeing a pattern as only you could. Confidently strike a key, and the doors hiss open. Failure, uh, combat. So, uh, I can automatically change the result to wisdom. <laughs> oh, because of your stims? My brain stims. Yes, I, sus I think that you, in fact, should roll this. Yeah, I think that's a really good idea. Great. Well, you study the symbols, seeing a pattern as only you could. Confidently strike a key and the doors hiss open. You turn the next chapter card. Oh, look. Oh, it's wisdom. <laughs> Well, wow. this this, this game really does hammer home how good drugs are. Yeah, yeah, no. The, the <laughs> like drugs up. are. If you're in space, <laughs> drugs. The the stim the stim items are easily the best items in the game. In yeah, of, like, I can see that. If you can get them, you can sort of cheese a few things. Although obviously some of the cards say you specifically, which means that you can't nominate a crew member. Yes. To hope, it may. This is the last chapter die before the boss, no everyone. Oh, goodness. It's so okay. Oh! Okay. Whoa. Oh. Oh. What's that? Oh. 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 Come on. Yeah. Yes! Give it a biscuit! Carry on. Oh, you can't it. expect me to ignore her. Uh, well, something really horrible is on here compared to Watson. Um, a, sh a screeching alien pounces from the darkness. It's hook-like limbs pulling you close as it lunges to bite you. Oh. You must roll a cunning in one attempt or lose HP. Two, in fact. Then as a group, choose one option. Attack! Take it down. Begin close combat. Attack. Eva no! Evade! You lose an additional HP, shaking off the terrifying creature before you flee down the corridor. Uh, shall we see if I can roll cunning first? Yes. Because that will. Uh, yeah, you, yes, you, you must, in fact. How much, how much health I lose? No, that's not an ammo die! What am I doing? Did you roll a cunning bullet? I rolled a bullet! <laughs> well. That's not cunning. Mm -hmm. that is uh -oh. I lose two, two HP. HP. I could, I could lose an, I could lose another one. I'm on eight, which is easily the highest health of all. So firstly, well, now I'm on six, but if I lose another one, then I'm only on five, and that's. I mean, look, I'm just I think you must. Lowly and Johnny. Yeah, I think you must. I think you must sacrifice yourself. I give my the love, greater good. love for honor. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> but for 
for you. There you go. That's what I was singing while this alien bit me. <laughs> when he bit me, he bit me. He bit me. He bit me. We've made it to the boss, everyone. Yay. Oh, my goodness. Are you staying for the boss encounter? She's not. Uh, She's right. out of here. Johnny and I have the same amount of health. So I suggest it would be potentially one of us two. Because I'm afraid of bad things happening to whoever reads this card. I don't uh, But first you have it. to read this bit on the back. <clears throat> this is it. If your senses are correct, behind this door is the hangar where your ship is being held. But by whom? You prepare yourselves for one final battle. <gasps> Turn over now! Yay! What? Oh gosh! It's Sergeant Steele! Um, let's see what you've got, he that says. Like. Yes. Wow. Uh, he's got three fist die. Uh, dice, two sprinkles, and three randoms. Um, Hello, I'm Duke Ken has done a super chat saying, you are doing good, Alex M, with the high health. Is that like the new Becky with the good hair? Yeah. <laughs> Alex with the high health. Not for long, <laughs> with Sergeant Steel around. Sergeant Steel. Uh, would you, Johnny, would you like to read the combat special? <laughs> All right, mate. Um, yeah, welcome to Sergeant Steele's um, Combat Cafe. We've got a combat special on today. Uh, whenever a member of the crew blocks Sergeant Steele, they are stunned and cannot take any actions the following round. If a round begins with all members of the crew stunned, <gasps> Sergeant Steele triggers his d dreadnought armour to auto-repair instead of attacking. You roll a chapter die and roll it. Add it to the row of those. Remaining. Guys. Bugger. The yeah. three random dice, I just rolled three more fists. Oh, Which God. means there's not a single eye on this table. Oh, no. And that's my only strength. Oh, no, I've got my... Stim. I've got so much you have mm. your power, Stim. I yeah. suggest we try and shoot this person first. Uh, yes, I mean... Oh, yeah, oh no, yeah. hang on, this is terrible. We can't shoot them. Have you seen the thing? Yeah. It takes oh. two of each type of ammo to do any damage. Oh. Oh dear. I mean, I mine no. Oh wait, my if I roll a crit, if I can If we roll do... a crit, we might as well. Sh okay, we might as well try and shoot him. Might as well try and shoot him. Why? I what what lowlies? What? Why would you do that? Why would you not just do close combat? Because we can potentially Johnny and I can actually do two hits if we roll our special. Thing. There's, a, there's a one in six chance of critting. Uh, right. I might just do a uh, medical medic bay, whatever that's called. Yeah, med droids. Just, yeah. just to just to get me in in the fighting spirit. Good no. idea. <laughs> what are, what are, what exactly are flank actions? Oh, uh, flanking yes. is quite good actually. Um, we put our die there. Mm. Uh, in this case, it would have to be the crew die. Uh, and what happens is. That's our assigned action for that turn. Then uh -huh. next turn, before everyone else goes, that person gets to go, and if they okay. hit, they do double damage. Whoa! That's amazing! I think we should try that in close combat. I agree. Uh, but let's try and let's try and get a crit with our with our guns on yeah, Sergeant it's just, Steel. Oops. Systematically fun, isn't it? I can see people uh, in the chat being like, uh, why are you doing this? Other, other dice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why are you doing this? Okay, you ready? Come on, baby! Yes! I did it! No way. Oh, I didn't, oh, but that, I'll wait. still take that. We do uh, and damaged. <laughs> yes! Yes! Let's take what away one of the fists, huh? Yeah. Oh, pardon me, what's Wait, it? does everyone take three damage now? No, we've got to try. We've got to roll a hit die, me and Johnny. Oh, oh it's only close combat that we automatically take it. Yeah. Oh, right. so we don't want to close combat. Roll a hit, roll a hit die, please. Nothing. Nope, neither did I. Yay! Oh, <laughs> nice one, Sergeant. Yeah. Uh, bad at bad at fighting. Sergeant Bob. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. 
Oh, yeah, sorry, that was, I used to that be was pretty real. Really sorry. So here's a quick question then. Hello. Because I... Right. So are you guys going to do the flanking thing now? Uh, one of us could, yeah. Why? Yeah. Okay, because I'd like to now shoot before we move to close combat. Because I can't, I won't, if I move to close combat, I'm only going to be around for one round before I die. I will say yeah. you can't do any damage with that gun because you're, you can't get crits with it. Oh, really? Oh. Yeah. Like it says that symbol means that your, your thing just overheats and you lose health. Oh, okay. Oh, that's less. It's that's not less. a very good gun. I'm no, sorry. it's not. I really thought I took the good one. It did look cool. <laughs> you wanted it. Yeah. yeah. Um, we can go into close combat. If you take cover, you um, you won't be hit. If you take cover, we can just stick you in cover if you want, or you can you can fight. I mean, I'd like to fight to help, but also I will die if I fight. <laughs> yeah. How much health? I mean, I've got four, so I could do you one round of combat and then go into cover. Yeah. Okay. Let's and do you've that. got your um, may reroll your crew die and apply which result. Oh, you. oh, you've got would that it, um, Would it make sense to make lowlies do the flank? Could do, yeah. Because then you wouldn't take damage, but you'd be setting yourself up to do double damage next time. Mm -hmm. Yep. W so, whereas we can we can soak a little bit more damage. But do, wait, oh, wait, hang doesn't on. That, you... Doesn't that doesn't say roll a damage die? A hit die. Oh, yeah. Whoops. Can you flank in close combat? Let me just check. That's. Good question. Close combat action. You cannot flank in close combat. Oh, whoops. Okay. Oh, well. Oh, um, Revolver Rock says, if Lowly's is always in cover, oh, his special yeah. ability won't activate, even if the others are stunned. That's a good point. This is true. Uh, you can use flank attack. I think you just you just take, you just just take roll a hit die. Okay. Right. So, you, uh, so it... Lowly still has to roll a hit die and potentially get hit. Oh, okay. That's probably not great then. No, so, I'm just gonna roll my normal. You gonna you gonna go hit him? Yeah. Hit, okay. do, Johnny, do you want? I can flank, or you oh, can. Oh, I'll go on a flank. Okay, I'm gonna just do a normal hit then. Okay. All right, here we go. I go. Go go. Hey. I roll two wisdom, and I block, which my... means I'm stunned. Yay! My hit die was uh, blank, so I'm okay. Uh, okay, I take away two wisdom, but I am stunned for next round. That's not bad. Uh, yes. Lolis, did you get hit? Uh, well, I, yeah, I got, I hit him with a mite. Okay, but you took damage. I will now. Right, uh, Johnny, you have to do your flank attack now. Nothing would give me greater pleasure. You hey, hit, Sergeant you get Steel. You have an extra die. Get, get, uh, oh, I know this, no. whoops! You hit, yes! It's fine, I can, I can sort that out, it's fine. Okay, um, I you hit. You have an extra die, which means you get yeah. three dice. Mm-hmm. Get. And I'm stunned, done. but. I'll, I'll do with it, don't worry. <laughs> Let me just. No, 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 I've got <laughs> oh, no, it, I've got it, I've got it. Got it, got it. Right. Got it. Okay, you, wait, 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 Here. there you go, you found it! Yay! Good job. Oh, in my moment of triumph, I messed up the whole deck. Right. Now we get to have our normal move. So Johnny can go again if he wants. Johnny, we only have one fist left. Can I just go to the toilet now? No, Loli, I yeah? want something. <laughs> you've, got a, you've got a power stim, have you not? Yes. You know what that means? Oh, right. Oh, because I don't take damage if he dies. Okay, uh, here's a fist. Boom, done. See you later. <laughs> wow, that was uh, that was actually a pretty exciting combat. Uh, you wouldn't think it from the way that was that coup de grace was delivered, <laughs> which was just like, here's a die, mate. I need the toilet. <laughs> but, yeah, we've... I'm sorry, mate. Hang on, mate. I didn't mean I'm, a real toilet. I need the toilet. Let me just punch you once. And I'll go to the space toilet. I'm like, as I as I punch him, I'm like, I need to pee. Yeah. And then you go to the space toilet. But then I say, I need to pee on you in the face. See, see what I did there. Pee on you in the yeah. face. Yeah. I liked him when the dog was in my lap. That was nice. <laughs>
Dad still might have died from you just saying that. Mm. Um, okay, so we've we've done Sergeant Steel. We've actually completed the mission. Yeah. Uh, Lowly, since you <laughs> delivered the killing blow, yeah. do you want to? Uh... Mission accomplished, everyone. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Remember, survive the final boss. Nominate a player to turn this card and read it aloud. Oh, that was me. Sorry. <laughs> uh, mission accomplished. There she is, your beloved starship, the Equinox. You hurry aboard, fire up the converters, and breathe a sigh of relief to hear the main oh. engines kicking in. Without delay, you override the restraints and blast clear of the station, rolling out into the immense space gate beyond, heading for home at maximum velocity. Your adventure has only just begun. Way! We, well, we, we escaped. We did it, and it was easy. So we did easy. it! I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll let you into a little secret. This is the Go first on. time I've won this game. No way. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> I'm deadly serious. Wow. Well, I mean, I can see why. We're all pretty banged up. I'm on five health. I'm on one. Me and you're on five. Lowly's on one. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's... It was it was so easy. I was... Oh wow! And oh pizza, yeah! Oh yeah! Pizza, Absolutely. Piece of bread was that one? That was piece of bread. These are the other bosses we could have faced. Whoa! The oh, entity. Hey. The alien queen. Sarah Bron. And brother, uh, mother of machines. But no. The entity doesn't oh. speak. D oh look mm. the alien queen is German. D human. <laughs> that is not what it says. <laughs> I enjoyed that immensely. That was a very very good joke. <laughs> huh, well yeah, we not only escaped from the dark sector, but we did it in record time. It's twenty seven minutes past four. So piece of cheese, isn't it? Yeah, piece of cheese. I think we should, you know, uh, we'll bring the, the stream to an early finish. Uh, but yeah, that was that was really good fun. Thank you for showing it to us, Mia. Yes, thank you. <laughs> Victory! 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 Oh, I really want to um, draw a space toilet now. Yeah, good. let's draw a space toilet before we go. Why not? Uh, Emmy Little's done a super chat uh, with, I think that's a hippo, Maybe. applauding with the letters GG over their heads. <laughs> Uh, um, thank you very much for your super chat. I think I might have said a bad word earlier. If I did, apologies. <laughs> it might have mm. been fun, but oops. It... <laughs> yes. Why would you apologise for saying a bad word by saying the same word again? <laughs> I wasn't thinking. Evidently. Sorry, I'm so enraptured by your drawing of the space toilet. Yeah, do you like it? Oh wait! Wow. That's somebody using the loo. Okay. You know when you like when you're like on the loo and you like put your hand on your on your thighs. Yep. <laughs> Good God. You know when you're on the loo and I'm like, I mean, this is kind of a universal experience, but <laughs> I mean, I think whoever you said that to would probably be like, yeah, I mean, I've been on the loo at some point. Oh wow, why is that bread, Johnny? Oh what? no, that's lonely. Oh she's drawn a poo. It's lonely. <laughs> I'm drawing drawing wings on the space toilet and then obviously it's got a comb oh, wait. for oh, you, you, aerodynamic. You sit on the toilet and it blasts off. <laughs> yes, space toilet mate. I wasn't sure that's what it meant. I thought it was just, you know, a vaguely yeah, 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 yeah. intergalactic like, space toilet. toilet. Blast off in space is actually a euphemism for going to the loo and doing a poo. Okay, right, with that, <laughs> we're going to end this stream, I think. Uh, thank you so much uh, to everybody watching this stream. We've been uh, three-fifths of the Dice Breaker team playing Escape the Dark Sector, um, which is a board game that we... I liked that. That was fun. I liked the aesthetic. I don't know how many times I would, how many more times I would care to play it, but like, I, I still, I liked it a lot. It was yeah. a, a good giggle. So uh, thanks to everybody for watching. Um, and yeah, don't forget, there's plenty more than Dicebreaker for you to watch. Uh, like, subscribe, go to dicebreaker.com to read things, go to dicebreaker.myshopify.com to buy things. But most importantly, we uh, thank you very, very much for watching, and we wish that you have a lovely day. Goodbye. Yeah.